Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Mathematics channel with quick, relaxing and great challenges. And today we have a really interesting challenge, 2 times 2 divided by 2 and times 2. On the first side, this is like the easiest question you've ever seen, everyone learns this stuff in the third grade, multiplication, division, we have only two, so it's not like a huge number, it's a complicated expression, really great challenge. And what is the correct answer, what do you think? Right here we have three options, A, B and C, so right now I suggest you to pause the video, try to solve it by yourself. What do you think is the correct answer? It is a great challenge to check our answer in the end of the video, just trust me, this is very interesting and great challenge. Okay, here's our question, here's our answer, choose one option, what do you think is a correct answer to this question. So what we want to start solve this, right here we have 2, we have 2 times 2 divided by 2 and times 2. So here's our challenge and we need to understand what we need to do at first. Take a look closely, we have three signs right here, we have multiplication right here, sorry, the multiplication, first sign, yeah, we have the second sign, we have division, yeah, and the third sign we have this multiplication, so three steps. And in math we, should, we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem, because we can solve it like first step, second step, third step, or we, if we can start from this multiplication, then this division, then this multiplication, and a lot of combination, maybe a fixed combination right here. And obviously whatever order of operation we select is going to create a different answer, so we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. Yeah, and in math, in math we are interested in only in one correct solution, so we need to know what is the correct order to do this problem. And for example, let's look at this PMDMC order of operation. This is the most popular order of operation in the world. Old internet library, scientific graphing calculator works according to PMDMC, and I will solve it according to PMDMC. But this is up to you, you can solve it according to BODMAS, wherever you order, wherever you want, I'll solve it according to PMDMC. Okay, I hope you understand my thought that we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. We cannot solve this chaotically from left to right, we cannot jump, we should understand what is the correct order to do this question. And we have our question, so two times 2 divided by 2 and times 2. Okay, so PMDMC works from the top to the bottom and we need to apply this or PMDMC order of operation. So what is the first step? The first step parenthesis, the last step addition, subtraction, so let's go through the steps real quick. So the first step parenthesis, let's look at it, where do we have this parenthesis? For me personally, I don't see any parenthesis and we skip this part, we don't have any parenthesis, so it's it's really great. We don't have any parenthesis, any brackets. Okay, what about exponents? Maybe we have an exponents right here, no, I don't see any of those, we don't have any cubes, fifth power, tavern, 7th power, we don't have it, and we skip this part, we don't have an exponent part. Okay, then, multiplication and division group. A lot of students do this mistake, they say, okay, multiplication, now we need to multiply, yeah? But right here we have multiplication and division group, and we need to find where do we have multiplication and division sign. Let's look at it. So right here we have multiplication sign, we need this expression. Division sign, we also need this expression, and multiplication sign. So all the time we have this case, multiplication and division. So right here we have multiplication, one time or two times and we have one time this division sign. So we have one time multiplication and division sign. Moreover, we don't have any addition and subtraction, so we can easily skip this part with addition and subtraction because we don't have any signs, any add sign, any subtract sign, okay? We have multiplication and division right here. Okay, okay. so what is the correct order to do this problem? Because right here we have multiplication, division, multiplication, what we, need to what we need to start with, multiply, divide or this multiplication and here's my answer. We need to look at it in a perspective what is the first sign from left to right, okay? Three signs. Here right, right hand side, right here we have right hand side, right here left hand side. What is the first sign from left to right? Of course, this multiplication is the first sign from left to right. This is the second one, this is the third one from left to right, okay? So we need to start from this multiplication, so 2 times 2 is our first step. So we have 2 times 2 equal to 4, and we still have this expression, so 4 divided by 2 and times 2, okay? So right now we still have this division multiplication part, we, we need it, and right now what is the first sign from left to right once more? Of course this division is the first sign from left to right, and once more this the same logic, so we have 4 divided by 2 equal to 2 and 2 times 2 equal to 4, so we have right here 2 and times 2 equal to equal to 4. I know a lot of discussion about this, uh, what is the first division, multiplication, multiplication, division, I know about this discussion, but this is up to you. Whatever order of operation you select, you will have different answer PMDMC, answer is 4, maybe you, if you solve it according to a board mass, you will have the answer 1, this is up to you, this is um, up to your to your country, what your country uh, use this uh, order of operation, I respect PMDMC, I solve it according to PMDMC, and this is my explanation. Of course, any other order of operation, 
take place right here. So we can easily say that option one is correct. But according to PMDMC, correct answer is option C. This is this is four. So this is my explanation. I hope you understood my thought about it. And one really interesting note. Take a look closely. Really interesting algebra trick. So we have two times two divided by two and times two. Take a look. Right here we have multiplication by two and we have division by two. So it looks like we have like plus seven minus seven plus uh, ten minus ten. So right here we multiply by two and divide by two. So in our minds we can easily cancel this expression in the middle. And we have two times two, which is equal to equal to four. This is like a real great algebra trick. For example, you have like plus two minus two plus seven minus seven. And right here we have times two divided by two. So it, it's changed nothing for us. So this is my explanation. So I wish you all the best in your mathematic adventures. Thank you for your time and have a great day. See you in the next videos.